Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we'll learn how to create professional logos using a free tool called Canva. This will take under 5 minutes to create beautiful logos. So stay tuned for the rest of this video. First step in order to create logos is head over to canva.com and then it will take you to their home page. From here you can browse some of their pre-made sizes like a documents, whiteboards, Facebook covers, logos and stuff like that including YouTube thumbnails. So in this video we'll be specially focusing on the uh, logo category. And then in order to make a logo, you can get some inspiration from Canva from their templates because they have a, uh, because they have a large variety of templates pre-made. So in, in order so in order to check some of those templates, go to search bar and then type in logos. Click hit enter and then it will show you some logo templates. And as you can see, these ones are pretty nice. And then you can browse through and pick whatever one you like. And another uh, thing to note is, if you see uh, a small crown icon with the with the text Pro in any of these designs or elements that you will take, that means it's a um, Pro Pro uh, template or element, and and you need to. Uh, upgrade to Canva's uh, paid plan in order to access that uh, object. Now that we're done taking a look at their templates library, let's see how you can create your own personal and customized logo. So scroll up to the top of the templates pa uh, page and then click on this create blank option. And then from here we can start designing. So now let's go over the briefing for this logo design. The brief is on screen. Okay, so first off, let's pick a icon for our brand. And as the um, briefing said, we need to include an open book icon. So to find an icon that, that matches with the brief, we can go to this elements tab and then in this uh, in the search, we'll hit in book icon. So book is enough. And then in this uh, graphics section, you can click on see all to see a uh, vector, um, you know, um, book icons. And then you can uh, scroll down to see which one you like. So for me, I like this one. So just click on it to insert it into your uh, design, and then from here you can uh, you can do some of your uh, you know basic e editing features to it. Like you can edit the image. It's basic. Like you can put it on mockups and that stuff, and then you can crop it. You can flip it if you want, and then you can also change the colors and board style of it. And, and you can always animate it okay so we don't want to miss that now so we're gonna um, I, I, we're gonna make our logo now so I'm, I'm gonna scale this down and then we need to add our text so I'm gonna uh, go to this text tab here and then click on add a heading from here I'm gonna type our brand name book watcher scale it down so you can you know see it better okay and then another uh, handy tip is to use the arrow keys to move it in you know in precise movements so I'm using that now okay so now uh, let's create the our tagline as as per the briefing so it's 
tweak it around uh, so that uh, everything matches. Okay, so now that we're done and, and we have a good design that we like, we can move on to customizing it by changing colors and the fonts. Um, so as per the briefing, we want a, a, a warm, elegant color theme. So I'm going to click on the element I want to change the color of. And I'm going to click on this color button here. And then I'm going to change the color. So I'm, I want to add a new color. And you could of course use any, any solid colors you like, which are default colors. So I'm going to hit on this add a new color button. Then I'm going to make a nice color for myself. I think I want to do an orange kind of theme. Because it said it's a, it was a uh, warm theme one. Okay, I think that orange looks pretty nice. Uh, and, and I'll change our um, logo text also to this orange color. And now we can uh, go on to changing our fonts. So as the briefing said, we want an uh, elegant modern font. So I think uh, this font uh, will work because it looks um, elegant and, and you know, modern at the same time. And for our um, tagline, Hagrid will work, this font. And then if you want to um, export this, just, uh, just go to the t top of your project here and then click on share, go to download and then uh, s select uh, any of these. So you would need a pro account for uh, SVG. Um, so I don't have that, but but if you want, you can export as a SVG, which is a which is a vector graphic. So just for now, I'm gonna click on PNG, click on, and then click hit download, and then it will take a bit to download. So we're done, and then I'm gonna download it. Just like that, save. Okay. So yeah, that's how you make a. a a professional logo in Canva in under five minutes. I hope this video uh, helped you to make uh, you, your own logo for your brand. And until then, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.